back at it again and uh we've got an interesting video at least from the title <laughs> i'm sure it's gonna be a very very interesting video uh so yeah like share comment hit that subscribe button if you are new shout out to the babylon b if you're not subscribed to their channel already make sure you go subscribe all right go show them some love and support and let's dive in Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg has officially indicted former U.S. President Donald Trump with charges for 34 felony counts. And the crimes he's charged with are doozies, quite the humdingers, a real brouhaha. I do not think that means what you think it means. In addition to potentially violating campaign finance laws by paying hush money to Stormy Daniels, the list of accusations becomes more serious further down the line. For instance, Bragg provided the court with distinct photographic evidence from 1992, where Trump once entered a crosswalk while the countdown was all the way down to four. Insidious. Ignoring the FBI warning, Trump made a bootleg VHS copy of Home Alone 2 so he could watch himself over and over again. Pure evil. Trump broke all 50 of the craziest U.S. state laws, including Connecticut, where he sold a pickle that didn't bounce, and Pennsylvania, where he ate peanuts while walking backwards in front of Barnstormer's auditorium, get this, while a performance was underway. He sold a pickle that didn't bounce. <laughs> I'm almost afraid to ask if that's a legit law, because there was something that I came across <clears throat> a while back um, that was showing some of the crazy laws some states have on the books like legitimately have on the books and it's just like some of the wildest and dumbest stuff it's just like wait how is this a law <laughs> oh man I, I need to i need to find that video maybe we can make it maybe i'll make a video on it or something because I, it, it is pretty wild some of the laws legitimate laws that are on the books in some states i mean it's absolutely ridiculous like you can't you can't uh, walk backwards down the street while eating an ice cream cone. <laughs> like, that's against the law or something. You know, it's like weird stuff like that. We're just like, huh? Like, who even thought of this? Like, like what person was walking down the street backwards eating an ice cream cone that caused this to be a law? Like, somebody got hit by a car? Like, well, what, what happened? <laughs> it's, it's some crazy stuff. But anyway, let's continue on. <clears throat> the Unstormers Auditorium, get this, while a performance was underway. The oh, unmitigated man. gall. Jeez, and in 1997, Trump tore the tag off a mattress, despite oh. the explicit warning that it was illegal to do so. Literally the worst. Trump has not returned. <laughs> lock him up now. We must lock Trump up. This guy breaks all the laws. He tore the tag off of the mattress? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That is absolutely unacceptable. <laughs> Why is that against the law? Can anybody tell me? Let me know in the comment section, <laughs> please. Like, that's a genuine question. Turned his local library's copy of The Art of the Deal so he could always say they were out of his book. Trump clicked the button acknowledging he read the terms of service agreement for Truth Social, when in fact, he did not. He didn't silence his cell phone, which ended up going off during one of the final scenes of A Quiet Place. Disgusting. And according to eyewitnesses, he once tried to get a table at Din Tai Fung. Before Din Tai Fung? Or his entire party was present. Lock him up. <laughs> Lock him up. Lock, Lock, Lock him on, up. On numerous occasions, Trump used his fake publicist alias John Barron to write positive Yelp reviews for Trump stakes. Once he ignited a sparkler while the forest fire danger warning was moderate. He went to the bathroom without a hall pass in high school. Once oh. he flushed a feminine hygiene product in the toilet instead of placing it in the bin provided. He unplugged a USB drive without ejecting it first. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, man, we must lock Trump up, man. This, this guy's dangerous. He's dangerous. Trump is a danger to humanity. This guy's ripping out USBs before even ejecting them. Oh, no. This, this, this guy's an absolute menace. He's a menace. <laughs> oh, man. Goodness gracious. 
Oh man, these guys are good. I love the Babylon B, man. These guys, these guys are incredible. Instead of placing it in the bin provided, he unplugged a USB drive without ejecting it first. He took a bite out of a string cheese. He unbuckled his seatbelt on a commercial flight before the seatbelt sign went off. And possibly most egregiously, Donald Trump didn't rewind a copy of The Gender Dead Man starring Gary Busey before returning it to Hollywood video. And things took a turn once the charges were read and Trump responded that he was, and I quote, not guilty. But if I were guilty, I would be the guiltiest person ever indicted. That's what everyone tells me. Meanwhile, in other news, President Joe Biden was relieved to learn that the president currently being indicted for shady financial dealings was just Trump. Phew. Close one. <laughs> I want to run it back because there was a lot going on at the bottom of the screen as well. Uh, so Donald Trump with charges for 34 felony counts. We're going, we're going to run this one back a little bit. Scientists at Budweiser attempted to discover how many beers it would take for Dylan <laughs> to pass us all. Oh, no, you got to get the beer goggles on him. Okay, Trump pins his first prison. <laughs> Chad GPT launches every new couple. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Chat GPT launched. Hold on, let me, uh, let me move this up a little bit so y'all can, can see that. <clears throat> Chat GPT launches every nuke on planet after being asked to write another sign as the head. Oh, I didn't even read the last part. I just I just saw launched every nuke and was just, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Chat GPT must be stopped. <laughs> must be stopped. Absolutely. Sign as the hedgehog. <clears throat> okay. Judge for Trump trial revealed to be a uh, kangaroo in a powdered wig. Oh, man. Kangaroo court. You get it. Uh, Chat GPT launches every look on the planet after being asked to write another. Oh, well, this is the same thing. Are, are these all the same? No. That was just a repeat. Democrats throw biggest ever fundraiser for Trump campaign. Yeah, basically. Uh, when, when they try it, when, you know, as they're trying to lock Trump up, uh, I think Trump raised like, I want to say it was like $5 million, like overnight. <clears throat> in like 24 hours or so it, it, it was a it was a large amount of money um which is crazy so yeah that, that's that's a true statement uh owner of 73 purses questions the need for more than one cool knife i'm <laughs> ready to replace laura croft in the next tomb raider game sheesh i forgot about the game tomb raider as Trump fans gather in New York, FBI agent uh, excitedly dons MAGA hat one last time. I need to get me a MAGA hat. I don't have one. I need I need to get one. Um, chiropractor promises he'll have you. <laughs> wait, he'll have you good as new after 328. <laughs> I've actually never gone to a chiropractor. Uh, so if anyone. If we have any chiropractors in the uh, comment section, talk to me. If we have anyone that's visited a chiropractor, let me know. How, how, how'd you genuinely feel after? Did you feel like it really helped long term? Um, did it help your issue? Did it feel great? I've watched videos of it. I've talked to a couple people that have gone to chiropractors. Everything that I've seen and I've heard, it, it, it feels amazing. I have heard one horror story, though. Where a chick got like paralyzed um, after she went to the chiropractor, or like died or something. It was some. It was some crazy. Either she was paralyzed or pine boxed, cause like something with her neck or something like snapped and yeah, it it was all bad. So yeah, um, <laughs> watching some of these videos of the cracks and you know people seeming to feel relieved i mean you know it kind of has me intrigued but y'all let me know in the comment section um <laughs> frightening evidence reveals man convicted of making hillary meme has plans to create biden gift <laughs> oh man tyler breaks usain bolt's 100 meter dash record after parents ask what's in his mouth <laughs> hey all the parents know hey that's facts. That is facts. When your kid, have, you know, for, for all the parents out there, no disrespect to anybody that isn't. But, hey, I encourage you. Hey, you know, if you're in a great position in your life, you're with the person you love, you know, uh, you know, obviously. 
um, yeah, have some kids. It's a beautiful thing. It's, it's, it's wonderful. But <laughs> all parents know when your kids go quiet, oh, that's, that's, that's when you, that's when you need to start paying attention. That's when you need to, you know, Hey, hey, what you doing? What you, <laughs> what you got in your mouth? <laughs> and that's when they take off and start running, <laughs> you know, laughing the whole time, giggling. So yeah, that's facts. Uh, man who exited ed- elevator on wrong floor forced to re-enter and complete remainder of ride in shame. Goodness gracious. Aiden getting excited for annual chance to whack sister with palm branch. <laughs> Trump uses <laughs> uses his one phone to call. Wait, to ring. We're on the phone call. Sheesh, I, I can't talk. The stuff booting across the screen is messing me up. Phone call to ring up Ron DeSantis and yell at him. <laughs> uh, scientists discover strong correlation between trust in government and eating paint chips. Oh. <laughs> oh, I might steal that one. You trust the government? You must have ate some paint chips when you were younger. <laughs> hilarious I'm, I'm, I'm taking that one i am taking that one need to put that on a t-shirt matter of fact hey merch coming soon stay tuned merch coming very very soon um yeah that might go on the t-shirt though something along the lines you trust the government <laughs> you must have ate paint chips when you were younger <laughs> oh man that's hilarious media worried <laughs> this hitler fellow could cause violent backlash against... Oh, my goodness. Uh, Pelosi, we have to convict convict Trump on the charges to find out what is in them. <laughs> that sounds like some Pelosi stuff right there. Centuries old architectural marvel. Uh, perfect location for Burger King billboard. Oh, goodness gracious. Democrats remind everyone Trump is guilty uh, until proven guilty. <laughs> That's fact. That's facts. <clears throat> that's that's the way they feel. He's guilty until proven guilty to the left, which is very, very unfortunate for our legal system. But, oh, man, it's still Trump 24, baby. They don't have any choice. They don't have a choice. He's got the dub. He's got the win already. I mean, it's, 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 it's pretty much signed, sealed, and delivered. But anyway, y'all let me know what you thought about this one in the comment section below. Like, share, comment. Hit that subscribe button before you go. Peace and love. I'm out.